Well, in this video, we're going to be talking about division of uh, polynomial functions. Division of polynomial functions needs a good experience on addition, subtraction, and uh, multiplication of polynomial functions. It's not only dividing polynomial functions, but also it's about addition, subtraction, and uh, multiplication of polynomial functions. That if you have missed something on them, don't worry, you can go back to my videos and uh, watch them, then you can update yourself, then come back to division of polynomial functions. Let's see the definition of uh, uh, division of polynomial functions and uh, uh, do one example. The quotient of any two polynomial functions f and g is written as f divided by g and is defined as f divided by g of x, which is equal with f of x divided by g of x, provided that g of x is different from 0 for all x from set of real numbers. Because uh, uh, the polynomial functions that we are considering at this level are uh, polynomial functions over set of real numbers. So let's, let's uh, proceed to uh, the given example. The example is uh, uh, this one. It's uh, dividing 4x to the power 3 minus 3x plus 5 by uh, 2x minus 3. So this is uh, uh, degree 3 a polynomial and uh, the divisor is a uh, degree one polynomial. Uh, when we consider polynomial functions uh, under division, the degree of uh, the divided has to be greater than or equal to the degree of uh, the divisor. So uh, now we can we can undertake the long division process. Let's let's put them this way and uh, let's see how how we can divide uh, uh, polynomial functions. Then uh, uh, 4x to the power of 3 minus 3x plus 5 is uh, the dividend and uh, 2x minus 3 is uh, the divisor. When you, when you divide uh, any two polynomial functions, you always consider the leading term of the dividend and the leading term of uh, the divisor. The leading term of uh, the dividend is uh, 4x to the power of 3 and the leading term of uh, the divisor is uh, 2x. And now we will divide 4x to the power of 3 by uh, 2x. So uh, the quotient is uh, 2x squared. When we divide, when we divide 4x to the power of 3 by 2x, uh, 4 over 2 is 2, and x to the power of 3 over x is exactly x squared. So the quotient is uh, 2x squared. Let me write down the quotient first. And we have to multiply the quotient by uh, the divisor. So the product of uh, 2x squared and uh, 2x minus 3 is exactly equal with 4x to the power of 3 minus 6x squared. So this is going to be subtracted from uh, uh, the existing divider. So don't forget to distribute the negative sign into both terms. And then after distributing the negative sign, then the terms will change their sign. So 4x to the power of 3 minus 4x to the power of 2 will be 0. And then 6x squared is not like with uh, any one of uh, the terms. So uh, we're going to write down 6x squared itself and we'll have uh, 3x squared plus 5. So, the existing dividend is uh, uh, 6x squared minus 3x plus 5. And uh, the leading term of this one is 6x squared. So we will divide 6x squared by 2x. And the quotient is uh, uh, 3x. So write down 3x first. Next to uh, 2x squared because uh, this is the quotient. And uh, 3x will be multiplied by 2x minus 3. And then uh, uh, we're going to subtract the product. 3x times 2x minus 3 is equal to 6x squared minus 9x. And then this has to be subtracted from uh, uh, 6x squared minus 3x plus 5. And 6x squared minus uh, 6x squared is uh, 0. And then uh, we do have uh, 9x here and minus 3x here. Minus 3x plus 9x is uh, 6x. And you do have 5 here. So the remaining dividend is uh, 6x plus 5. And then 6x is uh, the leading term and divide. 6x by uh, 2x. So 6x divided by 2x is uh, 3, and 3 has to be multiplied by the divisor, and the uh, uh, product is 6x minus 9. And we have to we have to subtract this one from uh, 6x plus 5. But uh, we, we have to write down the quotient first. And uh, uh, the difference of uh, 6x plus 5 and uh, 6x minus 9 is uh, uh, 14, which is called the remainder. Now, the degree of the remainder is uh, less than the degree of the divisor. Now we stop division. So uh, 14 in the remainder and 2x squared plus 3x plus 3 the quotient. And uh, uh, this is all about division of polynomial functions. 
So you can divide polynomial functions this way. Thank you very much. I'll see you in the next video.